Hello everyone and welcome back to Warrior Cats The Untold Tales and we are back with Renfeather, our warrior of ThunderClan and we just slept the night away inside of our little den. This is so adorable. You can come down into these bushes and take a nice long nap. So now we need to go out and we need to get something to eat today. So we only have one reputation left with ThunderClan. I'm a little bit nervous about that. So we're going to step over to Frost Willow, who is in charge of the prey pile here and that's actually interesting to me because we don't have anybody in our sims 3 warrior cat series who is in charge of like distributing the prey pile but i think that it would be good if maybe we added that in so already and let's go ahead and get a little bit of food yay so we got some food from the prey pile but now i have zero reputation with thunder clan so if i don't want sky star to kick us out we need to go and do a little bit of hunting for the morning so come on Rinfeather. all right goodbye roseheart goodbye dragon soul oh it's this hey grafer how are you can i can i just come talk to you fellow fellow thunder clan cat uh apparently not that's okay all right come on rin feather all right we're gonna have her do a little bit of hunting but you guys oh my gosh i had no idea that you would all be so excited yes and we got it that you would be so excited about us having let me go ahead and drop that flower because i don't think we need that flower right now oh my gosh what's going on over here rain rose is this a raid by oh run for it I'm, I'm too, I'm too, like, small to fight them off on my own. Oh, it's a branch fur. Branch fur, help me out here. Help me out here, fellow ThunderClan cat. There's a raid. Ah, I'm getting attacked. I, I'm not, I'm not strong enough for this. Guards, guards, there's a raid from, whoa, there's a, get out of here. Okay, I've got to run for it. I'm not strong enough. I can't fight them. Help, help. Clan, please help. There's a raid from from River Clan. I can't believe that. Oh, Frost Willow, what do I do? What do I do? I, I come bearing the food at least. I'm gonna go ahead and drop it. Oh, thank goodness. Now I've got a couple more reputation. But I'm hurt again. That is not going to help me out. I just was over it by Cloud Leaf healing up and uh, now I need to get more reputation in order to be able to heal myself. So this is this is a lot trickier than I thought. Rin Feather is really struggling with the life of a wild cat. Dang it, the mouse got away. Did I get that one? All right, we got that mouse at least. So we're gonna do a little bit of hunting and because we're young and apparently very fragile and weak, we are going to stay near ThunderClan. There's actually a lot of other ThunderClan cats around right now too, which is pretty interesting. All right, there's a little mouse. I wanna get that little mouse. All right, come here, mouse. And did I get it? Oh, there we go. Rinfeather is finally starting to become a better hunter. That makes me happy. Let's go drop these off and then I can heal up. Oh my gosh. I can't believe we've taken so much damage already. But you guys, thank you so much. Holy days. I did not expect. And there's a couple dead mice. There we go. Adding our reputation up. And now I can drag myself over to Cloud Leaf. I'm probably covered in scratches already from the other cats being so aggressive towards me. There we go. Healed up a little bit. Let's get let's get something to drink. Poor, poor Ren Feather. This has been really hard on her. But you guys, thank you so much. I was not expecting so much excitement over Untold Tales, even though it's clearly excellent and it's actually helping me really get into the warrior cats mentality. And that's very, very much needed if we are going to do really well with our Warrior Cat Sims 3 series, which really I think offers the best opportunity. Did I get it? I got it! Birchfur, this is mine. This is mine. How you doing, Birchfur? Can I interact with you at all? Okay, just knowing that there's more ThunderClan patrols nearby actually makes me feel a little bit better. <laughs> oh, oh, there's an apple! What the heck? That's so cool! I wonder what I can do with the apple. That's so neat. What happens if I bury it? I'm gonna pick the apple up. A delicious, a fruit with a delicious taste. That's interesting. And we do have some goldenrod plants, but I can't use them myself. I wonder if I can take these to the medicine cats at least? Let's go try that out. Let's go see what happens if we do that. Kind of spending our day just trying to heal and return a little bit of our reputation. Uh, hey, what do you think about what do you think about that? Okay, well at least I can make a little pile there. Um, actually, I think I can actually give the goldenrod. Can I pick it up? Aw, I think I I think. Oh wait, I need to have an empty. There we go. There we go. I think I can give the goldenrod to one of the other cats to potentially build my relationship with them. And you guys, uh, what about quick heart or wild nose? What do you guys think? Let's see what happens. Quick Heart's like, really? Okay, I don't think he's impressed with the goldenrod. Fine, I'm gonna make a little pile down here in the corner. My little secret pile of delicious fruit and, and flowers, and we'll see what, what they think of that. Hey, Wild Nose. Um, uh, Wild Nose, do you want, do you want some prey? Can I, can I offer you some prey? Is that, is that gonna be good? Oh, backspace to give an item from our inventory. 
Yay! Okay, so we gave Wild Nose a mouse. That's really fun. All right, so I'm still wounded and getting hungry. Now I'm gonna use the last of my reputation once again to go ahead and eat. Oh my gosh, I've got to I've got to go do some more hunting. I think Sky Star is keeping a very careful eye on me because so far I'm not proving myself particularly useful to the clan. But maybe we can go. Oh, there's some squirrels. Maybe we can go and find some of the herbs that would be really good to use uh, for our medicine cats. And there was another squirrel over here a second ago. Oh, a mouse. Can I get it? Did I get it? I got it! Oh, thank goodness, Rinfeather. So she's apparently a better hunter than I gave her credit for last time. So that's a good thing, at least. She's hunting a little bit close to Thunderpath, but I guess she's a little desperate. Oh, there's the mouse. All right, can I get it? Oh, right. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> We've got a lot of prey now, so maybe after a hard day of hunting, we can let Rinfeather get a little bit more reputation with the clan. But you guys, wow. I cannot believe it's such a simple looking game. But there we go. Oh, thank goodness. All right, dropped off a whole bunch of that. Now I have a little bit more reputation with the clan. It's also getting a little bit later in the day. Um, I think we can go ahead and try sleeping. I'm going to try to do just a tiny bit more hunting. Rinfeather is pushing herself super hard. Just right here. I'm a little bit of a scaredy cat, so we're not going to go too far from the entrance to camp since we have been, <laughs> we've been attacked. Oh, no, I stepped on the stick that's going to chase away any prey nearby. All right, there's a little mouse. Can I get it? And, oh, wonderful. All right, oh look, and you can pile, you can stack things. So actually two dead mice stacked on top of each other there. Okay, good to know. So you can stack objects that are the same and drop them off there. Yay, I have a lot of reputation with the clan now, so maybe they won't kick me out. That's really important. But again, thank you. I was not expecting how excited you guys were to try out Warrior Cats The Untold Tales. I'm really loving it. I think that this actually has a lot of potential and you would not believe how inspired I became last night. Let's go ahead and curl up. I'm going to take a snooze right over here as soon as we can. Can I not sleep? Am I too hungry? Am I too wounded to sleep? Dang it. I thought I would be able to sleep by now. If you climb into these little piles, then usually you can go to sleep and just kind of pass the day away. Ah, there we go. It has to be nine. Right there, and then is my health gonna go up? Yay, my health went up a little bit, that's wonderful. Okay, so we're kind of healing ourselves up. Maybe if I give this goldenrod plant to Quickheart, will he like it? Let's see what happens. Oh, is this for me? Okay, so I think they're more excited. I would be more excited as a cat if it was a mouse, so we'll have to remember that. And then maybe we can come over to Cloudleaf. Um, I get the feeling Rinfeather does not like being injured, so she fusses about it and goes and visits the other cats quite often if she needs healed. All right, there we go. And now we've got a little bit of reputation left. Whew, all right. Oh, thank goodness. Skyscar may not kick me out if we, if we can work hard enough on this. So let's see what Shine for needed again. The feathers found near the hills and the moors. So we'll go look for those feathers. And then Snowheart actually has a quest for us, needing some horsetail. Oh yeah, and that cat is actually hurt. So apparently horsetail will actually be up next to Shadow Clan's territory. So I might zip over there in just a second and see what it has to offer. No hunting over here. Ooh, I don't know about that. Thunderpath is scary. I'm not gonna head that way. We'll go this way instead and I'll search for any prey that we might be able to bump into. Is that horsetail up there? Are those ferns that we can possibly harvest? Oh, there's a mouse right here. Did I get it? I got it, yes, all right, dead mouse, wonderful. Oh, I'm finally starting to do a little bit better. I wonder if we have to go across Thunderpath. Let's continue working our way up this direction and see what happens. But yeah, even though it's such a simple looking game, I got so inspired. Last night when I was laying down getting ready for bed, oh, it's four trees, how cool. Oops, dang it, stepped on that stick. If any other cat was here, I would totally have given myself away just then. But I got so inspired for our Warrior Cat Sims 3 series because we had run around as little Rinfeather and I was just amazed. Uh-oh, Rinfeather, Rinfeather. Okay, open moors, hilly areas. Oh, dang it, she won't stop running. Rinfeather, why? Rinfeather, stop. Okay, oh, there we go, I've got control over again. Run for it! I'm in the wrong clan, that was what, oh, there's a feather! You guys, a feather, yes! Okay, let's pick it up and we will take it and give it bird feathers. So I've entered, uh-oh, I've entered other clan territory. Ah, run away, ah! Is this Thunder Clan? Yes, this is Thunder Clan, this is my clan. Okay, I better dive in here. No, they're ganging up on him! Attack, attack, Cloudridge, attack! Oh my gosh, <gasps> no way, are we taking out River Clan? 
Oh my gosh, we just participated in the River Clan raid and we managed to get a whole bunch of experience from that, a whole bunch of reputation. Somehow Rinfeather with mouse fur and birch birch herb here, we managed to gain a bit of experience from that fight. Oh my gosh. But yes, like I was saying, you guys, I got so inspired from playing this last night that I've come up with quite a bit of the things that we needed for our our Sims 3 Warrior Cat series plots to continue on. And it is making me realize just how much fighting and reputation and kind of a, a edge of ruthlessness there really is to a wild cat's life and that is how the warrior cats book series is too so it's really helping me sort of focus on okay let's go ahead and get this bird ah i got away wren feather is not very good at catching birds unfortunately oh but there's a little mouse oh i stepped on a stick twice Oh, I bet the, the guard cats are actually just laughing about that. Roseheart and Dragon Soul are probably chuckling to themselves. All right, but we got some squirrels. We got feathers. We got more reputation. Oh, what do you think about that, Sky Star? Did I do a good job? Did I do a good job? All right, so I haven't gotten the horsetail yet, unfortunately, for Snowheart. All right, and let's go ahead and drop this. Wait, I think I need to, like... Shine fur, okay, talk. Yay, all right, talking to Shine fur actually helped to lift our reputation with them. All right, and then we will go ahead and drop both these dead mice and <gasps> look at that, you guys. Oh, we're building up some reputation. I think that's wonderful. Thank goodness, we'll get a little bit of food. Let's go ahead and heal up with Cloud Leaf. I'm really surprised that we managed to survive that battle. <laughs> we've died all of the other times we've tried to battle. But this is really, really helping and seeing your guys' excitement and your guys' ideas starting to come forward is really helping me with our Sims 3 Warrior Cat series, which has kind of been on a gentle hiatus for the last few, let's see what Deputy Prey Heart thinks, for the last few weeks because I got really tired and creatively needed a break and I'm feeling it come back to me. I have so many ideas for the third clan and the fourth clan in our Sims 3 Warrior Cat series. You guys just won't believe it. I'm really getting eager to add a lot more cats to each clan and figuring out how we can manage that game mechanic wise. Because look how many cats are in this clan. And we need more cats inside of our clans if we're going to be able to have babies that aren't like related to each other. We need to be able to have mates who are not related to each other. So I'm really getting so many ideas from this. And especially, as usual, from your guys' excitement. So thank you. All right, pray heart. Uh, we always try to maintain good relations with WindClan, but they have encroached too far on our territory. Recently, a scouting, a scout patrol of WindClan cats was spotted in the field just south of Four Trees. That area is ThunderClan territory, rightfully. I have sent some warriors out to chase them off. If you join them, reputation will be your reward. All right, we can definitely work on that. Did I already? Yeah, look at that! We have completed one whole battle quest. So we need to tell WindClan what for, what for, uh, which we'll probably do pretty soon. Um, I kind of like Wild Nose a lot. I don't know. Renfeather and Wild Nose, they just seem to be like more gentle, silly cats. So let's go ahead and head out and see if we can find a little bit more prey. Oh, but I also need to find that horsetail. <gasps> I just remembered. All right. Now Renfeather, I think she'd be feeling, ah, ah, ah. I was going to say more confident. I want to see, is that the horsetail? She's sneaking into ThunderClan territory, or ShadowClan territory, because I'm really worried about the hurt kit. And, oh, is that it? All right, let's run for this. Come on, Rinfeather. She's taking a big risk. Is that it? Yes, we found the horsetail plant, you guys. Oh, oh, but should she really be gathering prey in another cat's territory? Ah, oh, the bird got away. What about this one? But it looks so juicy and nice. Oh, that one got away too. All right, well, Rinfeather's probably lucky that she didn't gather up that prey because collecting prey from another cat's territory like that, what is over here, huh? Berry, what is there to bury? Hmm, didn't say anything. But yeah, we probably don't want to do that. Oh yeah, and if we attack trees, apparently you can get moss. So I'm going to have to figure out like which trees count uh, for being able to collect moss from. All right, and then let's come up. Hopefully this will help out. Snowheart, what do you think? Oh wait, Snowheart, I just need to talk to you. Yay, reputation has gone up. Let's see, four leaves here, two roots there. Oh, hello there. I'm sorry, I can be so absent-minded at times. Where was I? Ah, uh, yes, perhaps you can help me? One of my patients, Small Talon, was injured in battle. I need some herbs, but I have to look after him closely. Perhaps you could find me a goldenrod plant? I think there should be some growing wild in the forest. All right, so we can work on that too. Rinfeather is gonna get some sleep for now though. She's kind of an easily exhausted little creature. I don't think she likes fighting too much, but we'll have to see what happens because she already got dragged into that fight against RiverClan. 
So maybe River Clan will think she's some sort of big tough warrior when really she just wants to snooze. So we're gonna curl up inside of the brambles and go to sleep. There we go. And now it's green leaf six. So apparently once uh once every um new moon, so once every season. All right, let's get some food to start our day. Once every season, you can actually go and you can be at four trees when there is a meeting of the cats. So I would really, I need to figure out, oops. All right, good job, Renfeather. At the last second, she avoided stepping on that stick. All right, oh, look at all this goldenrod, wonderful. And we can collect up so much of it, that's fantastic. So we'll definitely be able to help out. Oh, and then there's a little mouse. Oh, it got away, darn. And then there's a little squirrel. Oh, it got away too. All right, come on, Rinfeather, you, you've got this. Did I get it? I got it! All right, we've got the little mouse. Can she catch any more prey? All right, there's a squirrel. Let's see if we can catch it. Oh, it got away. <laughs> that's kind of, oh no, it got away too. All right, well, that's just the way it works when you're not able to catch so many things. So let's go back and give them the herb. But this is really helping because it's like once you're inside of, there we go, the life of the warrior cat, you can really sort of start thinking about what our warrior cat series in Sims 3 can really benefit from. That's totally what I'm doing this for, but it's also fun just to watch little Rin Feather and to be among the usual clans. And now we actually have enough reputation. Let's come over to Night Feather here and let's buy a bonus coin. We did it! We bought a bonus coin! And so now somehow we've used up our reputation. Maybe I really want to see a way to like add some sort of reputation system casually into our Sims 3 Warrior Cat series too. That would be really fun. Um, and Sky Star and special abilities and traits too. Let's actually run to the back and see if we have enough experience now to go to Trainer Maple Stripe. Hello, Trainer Maple Stripe. And look at that, 32 experience points, that's awesome. Track prey, uh, instantly reveals any hidden prey and foes. Let's add in more to that. And then sprint, I think sprint would be good. Um, barrel slash roar of the lion, herb lore, hold your ground, allows you to specify an area for your ally cats to stay near. Uh, basic attack, we also have, let's see, killing bite, intimidating glare. The barrel scratch, leave your enemies bleeding. Hmm, I think that's a, I think we'll do sprint and then we'll try the feral scratch next because then she can kind of like dart forward, scratch and dart away. And I really love this idea of having certain battle traits or certain hunting traits or certain exploration traits that the cats can have that we could add into our Sims 3 challenge. And I do plan on running our Sims 3 Warrior Cats challenge kind of indefinitely into the future, especially as now that season one is wrapping up, I'm coming up with more and more ideas on how much fun it would be to add in all of these different things to make season two even better and I'm gonna try to write it up so that you guys can do your own warrior cats challenges if you so wish to but enough of that blathering let's go ahead and add sprint to this and I'm pretty happy look at that Ren feather is finally starting to get the hang of everything I think she's kind of eyeing up both quick heart and wild nose let's try uh, giving quick heart another item uh, let's see, I'm not sure if that will have appealed to him or not. I think Rinfeather just gets nervous around him. He's a little bit more of an intimidating cat, and so she tends to, like, drop whatever she's carrying in front of Quick Heart. So, oh, I love the little stories that are emerging from it. It's all about being able to tell stories no matter what your medium is, you guys. All right, ah, dang it. And the squirrel got away. All right, well, we're gonna go look at Sky Star for just a second. And if you guys have gotten ideas for our Warrior Cat series, please, please, please tell me. And we're gonna go ahead and visit the bonus shop really quickly. Okay, so it looks like we need at least two bonus coins to open up most all of these. Yes, to open up most all of these uh, different items, except we can make a new cat and, and it's free. And I think that just like adds another cat into your slot. So we'll have to think about that, but we definitely will do some run throughs. A lot of you guys want to do River Clan, Wind Clan, and Shadow Clan run throughs as well. And as long as you guys continue to watch and enjoy, then we'll keep going on. And I have to admit, it's really fun to be gathering up so many ideas for what we can do for our other series too, because Moss Clan and Branch Clan and the two other clans that I secretly know about and we actually have uh, running around in our world in the Sims 3 series, they're so close, close, close to my heart. 
It's really wonderful to feel my creativity for all of that come back the more we dabble in this and the more I see your guys' excitement in the comments. So share that excitement, share your stories of what you have done and really like the funky things that have happened while you've played this that have made really fun stories. That totally inspires me. I'm so excited to share the new things that are coming up and I will stop blathering about it and I will see you guys next time and we'll have to see if Renfeather continues on. She's managed to prove herself kind of by accident in a fight against River Clan, and we'll have to see if she's able to continue enticing one of the two males that are in the clan. If we're able to build our reputation back up or not, I feel like every time she gets a little bit of reputation, she must do something really silly that causes her to lose all of the reputation with the clan too. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>